Hello everybody, my name is Vital and welcome back to the let's play of this genre. Um, I think we're momentarily at episode 8. But yeah, it keeps on going. I like this game, so. Uh, still waiting. Let's see what happens next. Okay, let's go. Let's go then. Hostiles killed. Um, this was what I mentioned in a previous video, um, the overall chaos level. I, if you get it as low as possible, it's not high, as you get it low. Um, didn't kill anyone, well, I don't think that's something I can make at all. Ghost never detected, that's the thing I'm trying to get. I'm just trying to be not detected at all and just... Well, just keep killing everybody, to be honest. But only the bad guys, of course. Admiral Havelock and Lord Pendleton are in the courtyard. I expect they'll want to congratulate you. He's alive. Thank you, Corvo. Thank you. My uncle's a good man, and one day he'll prove it. He better. Here. I know you did this for the right reasons. Yeah, I did. But I want you to take this as a reward. It's an old heirloom one of my aunts gave me. Well, thank you. That wasn't why I saved your uncle, but still, thank you very much. They're all corrupt. If this is going to work, ask, we have to take attention. down the Lord Regent all and all of his key on the north. Uh, You did it. Somehow you took down the High Overseer Campbell against the odds. I knew you were our man, Corvo. With Campbell gone, we've hurt the Lord Regent immeasurably. And with Martin back, we'll have the finest strategist alive. The Lord Regent must be shitting himself in Dunwall Tower. Yes, and Campbell's journal, let's not forget. Our hope is that in these encoded pages, the location and condition of Emily Caldwin can be discovered. Yeah, because that's what I've tried to do. Our entire Save movement will mean course. nothing if we can't place the rightful heir on the throne. I know. Okay. I that. We must act fast. No doubt the Lord Regent is holding Emily somewhere, waiting to reveal her, to step out as the oh, hero by the way, to um, further cement his reign. Before I forget, guys, uh, if he doesn't bring the young lady um, forth oh soon, there will be um, infighting among the nobles as to who the should see the Empress. What kind of you want? I yes, time is against us. So but now you should take a well-earned rest. Game you think it's we good. will decipher the contents or of the High Overseer's or journal or and share them hey. with later. What's gonna make me pissed off? Um. Sleep sounds good. Uh, I didn't. <laughs> I didn't get. Uh, let's sleep. I don't care. It's probably gonna be uh, another episode where, <coughs> where I get some powers or some crazy shit from the the void. Oh no. Okay. Not this time. Oh, I still have some stuff here. Only books, I'm not gonna read all the books. If you guys really want it, it is every just buy it yourself. Duty to report <laughs> treasonous speech and action. The state depends on you. This is the second time I'm playing this game. I've already played it on the PlayStation 3. So, uh, that's where I read every single book, and at least every single storyline I could possibly find there. So, I'm not gonna do it again. And a lot of things are not even uh, connected to the I story. know the Golden Cat. At least not, not as a patron, mind you. To the main I story. designed some specialized devices for them. I kept blueprints. If anyone is curious. Don't. I brought you tea as a courtesy to a colleague. I won't make that mistake in the future. I'm sorry. I only thought... Never mind what I thought. Thank you for the tea. I have to get back to the Admiral. He has news for me. Okay, that didn't go uh to plan, okay. Let's see what kind of upgrades we can buy now. Corvo, my friend. Do you need ammunition or weaponry? Would you like me to craft something for you? Um yeah, let's have a look. The blueprint you have brought unboxes upgrade. Mask up. Okay, let's see. 
see a mask upgrade too. Oh, it's, you have to get a mech. Of course, you have to have one first. It kind of seems logical. Um, so well, let's get it then. Just see what it does. I don't even know what it does. Let's get both of them. And I'm broke again, as usual. Let's see if I can find some ammunition or anything, if I need anything. Mm, my health. Oh, I can't buy it because I don't have enough money. Oh, I can actually buy a room here for 500 cards. Okay, okay. that's nice to Left alt or something about soon. Oh, okay. I can zoom in now. That can, uh, that can be quite useful. Um, if I remember correctly, it's kind of You're lucky I keep you on. Lucky? This place would fall apart in ten minutes with me. Ah, wrong timing. Is that <laughs> so? In any case, you can't dismiss me. I went through the books this morning and found five mistakes you've made. Very well. You're lucky I found them before the Admiral did. <coughs> okay, um, whatever. The Admiral seems like kind of a douche, but okay. Uh, where do I have to go? Admiral. To the Admiral. Okay, to the douchebag. <laughs> Hello. Hello, Corvo. I expect I Martin will be joining us shortly. I hate to start your day with such a strange matter, but the servants heard something last night, moving through the storm drains beneath the building. Most likely a weeper, the poor bastard. There's no hope for them once the plague gets that far along. Nothing more than a shuffling corpse full of sickness and insects, if you ask me. I'd appreciate you investigating, just to be sure it's not a nosy guardsman that's getting too close. Here's a key to the hatches. I'd send a servant down there, but they'd die of fear on the spot, I'm afraid. Maybe Piero can concoct some sort of sleep poison for your crossbow if you want to go that way. Ah, I already have it. I already have it. Let's see. Sewers. Funny, right? Like you haven't done that before. Dropping down the sewers. Okay. Here already. Um, I don't know why I need to see stuff, but hey, why not? Uh, if I can find it, let's go bold. Stick on that. Idiot. Let's see. Um. like me to swim in sewage water. Oh, I'm back in the house now. Nah, wasn't planning on going back. Not yet at least. Again. Mm -hmm. Oh, of course. Uh, the, yeah. Because I died last time, I didn't have to devouring swarm anymore. Shit, that's fine. Um, another room maybe. Or is it just the old one? But still. Ah. Sneaky. Thank you. Four. Okay. 
Well, I guess so. Well, there was a shot. A shot. So we're gonna speed this up a little bit. Now that the Evan was outside again, so climb. Oh, <laughs> you know what? You went down there oh, in the sewers. On. I thought I heard a weeper in there earlier. You're probably the bravest man I've ever met. Overseer Martin has arrived. He's with Admiral Havelock now. They want to talk to you. Okay. What's up, bro? Corvo. I trust you remember Martin, an overseer before yep. and perhaps again someday soon. I owe you thanks for my rescue. Indeed. You've given us a glimmer of hope, Corvo. Because we've gotten what we've wanted from Campbell's journey. You've done it. We know where Emily Caldwin is being held. The Golden Cat, of all places. A bathhouse for aristocrats. Little better than a cursed brothel. But there's an unfortunate twist. It appears that Pendleton's own kinsmen stand in our way. The twins, Morgan and Custis. Not only are they controlling Emily, but they have the controlling parliamentary <coughs> votes we so desperately need. Yes, the Pendletons have to die. But most importantly, Emily must be brought here safely so we can protect her until the Lord Regent and his entourage have been dealt with. Pendleton's waiting for you on the dock. Okay. He's asked to brief you personally. I think it's best. Yeah. Corvo, a moment if I may. Corvo, I've asked to speak to you myself. You see, I'm sending you to kill my older brothers, Morgan and Custis. They're horrible men. It's true, as you may have heard, cruel beyond words. Mm -hmm. sure. Further, my brothers are close allies to the Lord Regent, and as long as they are in Parliament, we cannot gather the votes we'll need to stop the Lord Regent from further consolidating his power. These days, they're best known for exploiting their favor with him to cheat others out of their wealth. Let's just say that not every family evicted in quarantine for having the plague actually has the plague. Okay, I warned my brothers in every way I could. I really did. But they never did listen to me. They'll be at the Golden Cat tonight at their usual revels. They'll be protected by the city watch, so it'll be dangerous. Now go. Please do it before I change my mind. Okay. Let's go, go, go. I'll take you to the Golden Cat when you're ready. Yep, I'm ready. I've taken Lord Pendleton enough times, believe me. Well, good yeah. Nice one, man. Hmm. That kind of reminds me, how was I able to use a mask optics? You know, the zooming in part, without even wearing a mask. Hmm. I'll get you as close as I can to the golden beautiful. cat, Corvo. You might have to go the rest of the way on your own. The entrance is near Holker Square. The main thing is to make sure that little girl, Emily, gets back all safe and sure. Them two Pendletons are there, so I'm guessing there'll be a lot of guards. Slackjaw might have some ideas on helping you get inside the cat, if he don't kill you. This here's his territory. He and his Bottle Street gang hole up at the old Dunwall Whiskey Factory. They sell the elixir that folks use to fight off the plague. I'll lay low, but Let's keep an eye out for you and the little lady you bring him back. Good luck to you. I know Emily must mean a lot to you. Be careful going up the street, Corvo. A river hand I know pulled up alongside me last night and said there's one of those watchtowers on Clavering now. Okay. I guess you getting rid of Campbell shook up the Lord Regent. <clears throat> okay, so my actions.
Let's throw him somewhere where nobody can see. But um, so apparently, uh, the more people are killed, um, the worse the outcome will be at the end of the game. So I'm um, gonna try to keep as many people alive as I can. But well, you know, the game isn't meant to be. But I can always try. Oh. Come on. Some weird way I can't make it now anymore. Okay. Stupid cut. Look at the watch tower there, man. So hmm? sorry, I heard somebody was Kinda of reminds me of other game I uh, I play on on Steam actually heroes and generals. I know if you guys know the game. <coughs> Let's see where am I supposed to go? Again to the whiskey distillery. Okay, and then to the golden cat. Um, the whiskey distillery is probably only just to find a way there, find a way into the golden cat. But I think I'm might have already been familiar with it. Look, 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 look! I didn't kill it. I'm good, right? <laughs> Nice of this. Well, I might just be able to kill uh, these guys. Gonna do it anyway because they are probably infecting the city. So it's better to kill. Them. Oh, wrong button. gonna cut it here guys and girls of course um i will see you guys and girls in the next let's play um it will continue from here so as usual leave a comment leave a like and subscribe if you want um bye guys <laughs>